I saw. I leaned over the nest. There's two little tiny eggs about each this big. Even in super slow motion, her wings are a blur. She can flap up to 200 times per second. Drake, I think the hummingbird nest is a sign of peace. I think it's a sign of love. That's a good suggestion. I think we're very lucky to have this by our window. We sure are. Whoa! Oh, yeah. They matched! What? Yeah, there's a little baby bird in there. Here. She's sitting on the edge of the nest. They hatched! Oh my gosh! Mommy hummingbird has a lot of of work to do now. Her babies are hungry and depend entirely on her for food. The male's involvement is limited to the mating act. Then he goes to look for other females while the mother lays the eggs, incubates them for the required 16 days, and raises the young by herself. The newborn's eyes have not opened yet. The mother feeds them with a mixture of regurgitated nectar and bugs. The mother sits on her babies to keep them safe and warm until they have feathers of their own. Upon returning from our 10-day trip, I was excited to see how much the babies had grown. <sighs> My excitement was replaced by sadness when I realized one of the babies was gone. So we woke up this morning to find the baby bird about to find, uh, fall out of the nest. And as you see, her beak is longer, her body's bigger, and she's even sitting on the edge of the nest to make it pull back. I think soon she's gonna fly away. with nature. I decided this baby bird needed my help. By putting it back in its nest, it would be safe from ants, cats, snakes, and other dangers. Buying it time to go stronger and hopefully survive. That nest we made, we made it out of this lunch bag that we found. After we started folding back everything with this, eventually we got the nest. The baby bird looks exhausted from its struggle on the ground. It perks up as mommy tends to it. The bag nest has given the baby a second chance. Mother bird becomes very excited and appears to encourage the baby to leave the nest. 